Hello again, ladies and gents. This is Andrew from TeamGate CRM back with another video. And today we're going to go through our intercom integration, uh, specifically what it looks like in our intercom panel within TeamGate CRM and also how it looks in the intercom inbox. If you haven't already checked out the video on how to set up your intercom integration with TeamGate CRM, uh, I'll post it in the description below. Feel free to check it out to see how you can connect your intercom app within uh, two minutes. Once connected, what you want to do is navigate to either your people section, your lead section, or your company section so that we can view our intercom panel. Once we're inside one of the contact pages, you'll see on the right hand side our intercom panel down here. You'll see there's a contact here and a number of conversations which has been opened within intercom. If we expand this out, we can see each individual conversation. On the right hand side, it will display a status of that conversation so whether it's open closed or unread and we can also click into the conversation itself to view the conversation and what it looks like the other option is also once the conversation is opened we can also view it in intercom this view is very similar when we go into the company section however you'll now see multiple employees from the same company and also their conversation histories on the right hand side. When we go into intercom itself, you can see I've had a couple of inquiries here from myself. Uh, but if we have an inquiry from someone that is not within your TeamGate CRM, you'll have the option on the right hand side to create them as either a person or a lead. You can see that I've been created as a person, which has unlocked additional functionality such as creating deals. So if I was to create a deal, we can name the deal. So I'll call it intercom test deal. Where you can put in our price, select our pipeline and also which stage of the pipeline that it's in. So uh, whether it's interest, interested negotiation, decisional payment, we're going to put it in interested and we'll hit save. If we navigate back to TeamGate CRM and go to our deals, Go to the correct pipeline and interested and we can see that the intercom test deal that I just created for $100 is now in TeamGate CRM. That's all I wanted to cover today guys. If you've got any questions or comments or any recommendations for future videos, please be sure to let us know in the comments below. See you next time.